Okay, last question. You talk about mind control. Can you expand your thoughts on that subject? Mind control. <laughs> you know, when people think of the word mind control, they think of controlling other people's minds. And when I think about mind control, I think about controlling your own mind. Because, you know, while I am obviously a physical person and we spend a lot of this podcast tonight talking about physical culture and I embrace physicality, but we are our minds. And I'm not going to be, you know, going uh, into a Sam Harris philosophical rant on what it means and where the you actually is and whether there's a soul or a brain or whatever, your heart or some other conjured up place. This is what I know is that you, your mind the thing that is listening and comprehending these words right now, that is you. And that thing, that mind, you can control. You, you are the machine and you can control the machine. And people ask me, how do I get tougher? Mm. Be tougher. They, they ask me, how can I wake up earlier in the morning? The answer is, wake up earlier in the morning. How can I work out consistently every single day? Work out consistently every single day. How can I stop from eating sugar? Stop eating sugar. What about the emotions? How can I stop missing that girl or that guy or whoever, whoever broke up with me? How can I stop missing them? Stop missing them. That is mind control. You have that ability. You just have to assert it. You have to decide that you're going to be in control and that you are going to do what you want to do. Weakness doesn't get a vote. Laziness, they don't get a vote. Sadness, no, no vote. Frustration, no vote. Negativity, you don't get a vote. I don't even give my temper a vote. So the next time that you're feeling weak or you're feeling lazy or you're feeling soft or you're feeling emotional, tell them that they don't get a vote. Tell them you are declaring martial law on your mind. You're declaring mind control and impose what you want on your brain. Impose the discipline and the power and the positivity and the will and use that mind control to move your life where you want it to be is the things I always say get stronger faster smarter quicker friendlier more helpful more driven don't let your mind control you control your mind and once you control your mind, then you can set it free. And I think we'll close with that for today. Yeah. And that's about all that's I've good got. Good advice right there. And you know, if you're out there and you want to communicate with us, you want to carry on this conversation, you want to continue down this path. You can do so on Twitter. I'm at Jocko Willink, and Echo is at Echo Charles. Mm -hmm. I want to thank everyone for listening. I want to thank you for subscribing to this podcast, for placing reviews on this podcast, for spreading the word 
about this podcast. And most of all, I want to thank you for getting after it. This is Jocko and Echo. And until next time, out.